Welcome back for another part in our GM Connected series. And we finally got another home game. It's going to be pretty home heavy in the second half as we take on the Bills after our bye week. So, I've already done scouting, I've already done training and everything. If you go ahead and look at the league, we're 6 0, but the Jaguars are right behind us at 5 and 1. So, yeah, this is a. Uh, Gonna be an interesting game. We gotta keep winning if we're going to hold on to first place in our division. So go ahead and get right into it. In the off, in the bye week though, I did go ahead and uh, make uh, the decision to sign Adore Jackson to an extension because yeah, he's very much worth it. So I just decided to go ahead and get that done now. Concerned today in Nashville. Just enough chill in the air for a sweatshirt, light breeze, fall in full swing at Nissan Stadium. Nothing like the fanfare of introductions to an NFL game, and that was in evidence a moment ago. All right, it's game time. But yeah, like I said, I went ahead and uh, resigned him just because he's just so damn good for us. We cannot afford to lose him. So. It doesn't really make sense to franchise tag him with how good he is. It makes sense to just lock him up long term and just not have to worry about it. So, we went ahead and did that, and I do not regret it at all. Like, he's just been absolutely amazing for us. And uh, keep our defense together is definitely a positive. So, our team is mostly healthy right now, especially on the defensive side of the ball. Like, the guy I'm controlling right now, Ionis, is finally back. So we got a pretty pretty good uh, defense, all things considered. And our offense has been doing pretty well for us so far, so all things considered. I'm pretty happy where our team stands right now. Ooh, that was bad. I don't know why our guy up the middle came in there. I thought he was going to stay in his zone, but apparently not. So that was a pretty bad start, but... Yeah, hopefully everybody's having a good enough day. I haven't played a man in a bit, because like I said, I recorded the last two episodes back to back. And then I had the bye week. So it's been a bit before since I've played. So hopefully I don't do too bad here. But uh, luckily the Bills are not that great of a team. For some reason. They have a great quarterback, but uh, their team as a whole is not the greatest, as you saw on the intro screen. Like, we have quite an overall advantage. Now, this is an interesting spot to see if they go for it. Fourth and two of the 42. It's kind of no man's land. Yeah, they're going to go for it. And I do not really blame them for this. I would probably do the same thing. And we're going to screw it. We're going to blitz. I think they're going to hand it off. They did, and we were ready. We got the stop. All right, very nice. That was very close. Yeah, not, we got three yards out of that. That did not look like three yards. Yeah, that was very gutsy of them to go for it. Um, we're going to go with a passing play here. Brown might get open over the middle. We'll see here. Uh, we're just taking that, and we're getting out of bounds. But yeah, we'll um, have to see what we decide to do here with our quarterback situation. Because Tannehill is more of a stopgap than a long-term solution. Depending on how long the series uh, ends up going. So we'll have to... Uh, eh, I should have bounced. I should have gone outside there. I don't know why I did that. 
But if the series goes a while, we're gonna have to get a uh, long term option quarterback. Let's go tight end attack. I love that description because diagnosed is perfect on that one. Read his keys, made the play, and he can't. Well, there's no. Actually. Oh, don't tell me I was beyond the long yard of scrimmage. Uh, I was playing on scrambling for it, and then I saw how open he was, and I threw it, and I guess it was too late. So that's unfortunate. Um, let's go Titans Y cross. This has been a good play for us all year. But yeah, I should just. I guess I was too far. It didn't feel like I was, but I guess it was close. But we just were. Oh, there we go. Snagged on him. It was a bit of a risky throw, honestly, but uh, even if we turned it over there, I didn't think it was the worst thing in the world because we would have had a punt anyway, and they'd be on their own side of the field, so I kind of just went with it. Yeah, I didn't gain us much. Gain a four. It's not terrible, but let's double up with the runs. We've been going run, pass, run, pass. We're going to double up with the runs here. Hopefully we can get a nice block here. And we did. All the way down to the three. All right. I think we got this. If everybody holds their block, this should be a touchdown, I think. Everybody did not hold their block. Uh, let's go slants. See if we hit Brown here for a touchdown. Um, let's run it. Our receiver got caught in something. I don't know if it's not a receiver or what, but he got caught up. Down to the one. We're going for it. We have Derrick Henry. We're on the one yard line. Worst case scenario, we don't get it. And they're on their one. And we get it. I mean, if you're on the one and you have Derrick Henry, I don't think you could just take the points in that situation. And all right, it feels a little good. Our team is honestly coming together. I was a little bit worried about drafting a kicker. And not resigning our last kicker, but it honestly worked out really well for us. To get a kicker in the seventh round that ends up being a star potential is just fantastic. So, like, you could argue he's better, because I think if, I could be wrong, but I think in this game how it works is star kickers don't get iced or something? So, that's kind of nice. So... My buddy Billy had the best draft, though. But, uh... Yeah, the draft was live-streamed, but just didn't end up working out on my end. But, it, like I said, it wasn't that interesting a draft from our perspective, anyway. Because we were mostly shutting cap because of how close we were, so... Was not really the most interesting off-season for me, so... Well, let me know what you guys think about any lane offseason, if there's a particular way, because I don't know how to make it interesting. Because, like, it legit has to go week to week based on each person. So, like, if one of them is doing something in the offseason that takes longer than it would for us, because, like I said, we had no cap space, so we didn't, there's not really much for us to do. Ooh, that was almost intercepted off the, off the bounce, after it bounced off his hands. Yeah, let me know what you guys think about that, about how I handle next offseason. I tried to recap it and stuff, and there wasn't too much... Oh, I gave me the wrong guy. There wasn't too much craziness happening in the offseason for us, so... But, I mean, when the most exciting part of your offseason is uh, getting a kicker, you know, it wasn't that fascinating of a offseason. Yeah. I went for the home run, and I should have just gone to the right. I would have gone more, I think. Uh, let's try with another run. But, honestly, we could probably... There's a lot of position we could probably use in the draft. Like, obviously, we still need some upgrades to our offensive line. 
Um, and we could use some more depth wide receivers. So, I'm mostly happy with where our defense is. I don't think we need a ton there. Maybe another mid a middle, middle linebacker would probably be nice. But it's not our highest need, I'd say. I'd say our highest need's that offensive line. Ooh, he dropped it. It's admittedly a bit of a risky pass, but, I mean, if it hits him in the hands, he's got to catch it, right? Uh, let's go post-field drag. I really like this play. Seems like Brown gets open a decent amount of time, the time with it. Not this time, though. There we go. He was not who that play was designed for, but worked out getting it to Davis well enough. Glad we resigned Davis, honestly. That and we just, we don't have that much depth to wide receiver, honestly. Oh, he's gone. Okay, somehow he got dried backwards at the one yard line, and I'm not really sure how that worked. But, you know. This should do it, I think. Yep. There it is. I'm so glad we don't have to worry about resigning Henry for a while. Because um, the contract the Titans really have him on is better than anything we'd be able to get in this game. So I'm pretty sure he's up to like a 99 overall for us. Which is just stupid. I mean, he arguably is the best running back. I mean, there's um, I guess some be debate. Because I know a lot of people like McCaffrey, but... I mean... I don't know. I'm biased. I, I don't think there's a way to not be biased in that situation, but... The stuff Finry does is just amazing. Although I'm also the person that thinks there should be, like, an AFL MVP and, like... Uh, or not an AFL, an AFC... Uh, MVP and the uh, NFC MVP. Because they play mostly different schedules. Like, they play one of the opposite divisions. So that's like, I don't know. MLB does it. It's like the only one that actually does it right, in my opinion. Where each league has an MVP. I don't know. I think that each conference should have one. I think it'd make more sense. Ooh, did he actually hold on to that? He actually held on to that. Wow. I'm not even mad, that was just a nice catch. But that looks like he'll bring the end of the first quarter. Four, ooh, they ruled he got that that uh, playoff. Never mind. I was actually about to set my controller down for a second. But no, they, they ruled uh, they ruled they got that playoff. Okay, I'm switching to a blitz. I'm pretty sure this is a run. And I'd be wrong. Ooh. That was a very nice desperation play there. Alright, we're going cover two man here. I think our defense is good enough to play man coverage in this situation. Yep. I was right. They got the completion, but not enough for the first. I think you have to kick it here for them. And they, they agree with me, so. It's just too risky on your own side of the... Own side of the field. I could not drag him back in bounds, so that's unfortunate. Uh, let's try a jet sweep. Sometimes these go really well, sometimes they don't. We'll see how this one goes. I mean, get it too, I guess. Uh, good pitch hitch post. Between them and their opponent, it's really hard to narrow that gap. And the other part is they're taking their spirit away from it. Yes, he got it. That was a bit of a risky throw. I was not sure if he'd come down with that one. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna we're gonna fake a jet sweep here, but we're actually just running it with Henry. Let's see if we can catch him here. Not really, no. I mean, it seemed like a good idea. Ooh, play and post shot. We're going for the home run here. Give Brown a chance to make a play. Ooh, that didn't work. 
I didn't work at all. I was so busy looking. To, uh, we're just we're gonna play as conservatively, guys. We're gonna just throw a uh, screen here and hope for the best. Because I don't like our chances. Yeah, I just I didn't like our chances. I think we're more more likely to mess that up. So we'll just we'll punt this away. We'll try to pin them deep. See if they can down it inside the five. Well, that might be perfect. That is perfect. That is a fantastic punt. That is exactly what we meant to do. That could not have worked out any better. We're uh, bringing everybody and their mother on this play. Oh. hoping to get the safety there, but nope. But we're still going to bring pressure. Did not gain anything there. Third and three. We get them to have to punt here. That's huge. See if they're gutsy enough to throw it here. They are. Ooh, that was a good play. That was a very nice play call. I honestly kind of bought the that uh, it was a draw. So that was smart by them. Oh, that should have been intercepted. What is 29 doing there? That should have been an easy interception. He just didn't put his hands out. I am shocked that wasn't an interception. Nope, that's not a first. Third ninjas. I think this is going to be a pat. I think this is going to be a run, rather. I think they're going to run a draw here. Oh, I was wrong. I, I'm just, I'm not reading it right. So these are some good play calls by them, I'm not going to lie. I'm not reading them right at all. They're doing these little dink passes. And it's really having success for them. Rather, regardless of third in man or zone here. Oh. That was actually a good time. Uh, we're lucky that didn't get more. <sighs> Let's go cover two sink. In theory, I like this. It looks like we have most stuff covered. Alright, we actually did get them off the field, but they uh, picked up several first downs along the way. Uh, that was a good punt. I had no chance of returning it. Let's go my spot. Let's see if we can give Brown a chance here. That's interference? Hello? I am not sure how that was an interference. But okay, it, the game says it wasn't, so I guess it wasn't. Looked like he was all over our guy. Oh no. Oh boy, that was that was a mistake. That was an awful throw by me. I just I didn't I didn't read that well at all. Uh, I couldn't read that at all. But they did. Unfortunate. I just, I, I thought he was backing off. I could pick up a few yards and he came, like, by the time I hit it, he was come. 
Oh, it's a mistake. It was a very bad mistake. And that's just, that's a hundred percent on me. Uh, let's go inside zone. That's not going to work at all. Let's go Z spot. Oh boy. This is a really good defense they're playing, honestly. Let's go with the draw. Hopefully, uh, they're not actually. Oh god, this is. Oof. This is some really nice defense. Let's go wide corner. See if Brown can do something. We're lucky to pick up a first there. I did not see anybody open as he runs through the bench. He really looks... I'm going to try for worse here because I don't have any other passing play. Like, I could just tell that everybody and their brother was rushing me there, so I couldn't just run it into that. Two minute warning. Alright, we need to get our lead, our 14 point lead back, and uh, hopefully not give them enough time to answer to it. Ideally. Check it down. I didn't want to go out, I want to keep the clock running here. Uh, let's go wide corner. Smith looks completely unguarded here. Ooh, he wasn't as much as I thought. Um, stick a nod, let's go. Thomas looks completely open here. I'm going to take this for yeah. This time I'm going out. I don't. I don't want to take ten out again. Let's go to the screen. That gets the clock started again. That no go out. Okay, he's still in. He's still in. We're gonna choose some clock here. Um. Slants. I don't actually like this. I do not like this. It just doesn't look like it's going to work. Um, let's go X under. I like this more. It looks like Smith has a good chance here. Don't see anything. Buying time to his left. Yep. And he will score. Touchdown. Tight they just completely forgot about Tannehill. Tannehill with his 16th touchdown of the year. And the Titans find a way to stretch their lead. They're going to have a decent amount of time here, though. They have 35 seconds. All three of their timeouts. So they're, uh, they're going to have a chance here. See if they can do anything with it, but they're definitely gonna have a chance. 35 seconds with three timeouts is a lot of time to do something with. See if they play a conservative. We're gonna go cover six. We'll see if they play a conservative or if they go for it. Looks so like they're gonna go for it. Injury timeout. Ooh. Didn't look like that violent of a hit, honestly, but... Oh, that should have been picked. That 100% should have been picked. 27... If we get the stop here, we have time to do something. Ooh, 
that could have been Fig 2. We will have a few seconds here to do something. It's gonna be hard, but um, see what we can do. Ugh, that's not gonna work. I just killed our own clock. 14 seconds, two timeouts. Um, let's see what we can do. We have the whole field open to us. Let's go, let's go shakes. We maybe have three plays. Maybe. Ooh, I thought that had a chance. On stutter go, let's go for it. Bit of a Hail Mary situation. We really only have time for one play now. One second. One second on the clock. At least we have a ch we have a chance to hail Mary here. Actually, let's go goalpost. I mean, we at least gave ourselves a shot at it. Almost, almost. That was worth the effort. Good try. All right, we have a you know, we're still the lead at halftime. Still happy overall with our performance so far. Okay, Brandon, make sure you avoid the crazies out there and welcome in everybody to this Halloween edition of our EA Sports halftime report. We'll get started up at Lucas Oil Stadium in the capital city of Indianapolis. And it's the Seahawks who are out in front in the second quarter. Russell Wilson, responsible for the lone touchdown in the game thus far as he's thrown a touchdown pass. From there, we'll head to Green Bay. Check out the Packers at home, Lambeau, and they trail the visiting Lions in that one. Two touchdown passes for Matthew Stafford. Lastly, let's get out to Jacksonville. See what's happening with the Jaguars at TIAA Bank Field. And in that one, it's the visiting Dolphins who are out in front. The Dolphins looking to sew that one up, and they look to be in pretty good shape. In our game, it's been Ryan Tannehill, who's had the hot hand in the first half. His guys have the lead, as we'll hand it back over to our commentators, Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. All right, Coach, thank you, and we welcome everyone back for quarter number three. All right, we're back. We get the ball to start the second half. Hopefully we do something with it. As the third quarter gets underway. I got one extra yard out of it. But yeah, the big score that's interesting to us right there, the Jags are losing by three touchdowns right now. Uh, this might actually work. If we can hold our initial block, this could work. But it's a big ask, honestly. Oh, that didn't work. So if we gotta put us on initial line, it we had all kinds of green space, but we uh, we very much didn't. Let's go Ohio spacing here. Let's see if we can pick up something. And that's a decent gain for us, gain of eight. Duh, still a third and five though. Let's go fork wheel. Actually, we're probably gonna audible this. I don't really like it. Um, I'm gonna go Z spot. I think it gives us a better chance. There we go. He took a huge hit, but. I figured he'd be open just long enough to get open, and luckily he was. They're all pushing up towards the line. Let's go bench. Brown has one on one coverage. Ooh, if that was not right, if that was right on the money, honestly, Tannehill probably had that completion, but, uh, sadly, nope. Derek 
Henry. That'll leave him with a third and two coming up. They got eight yards. Uh, third and two is pretty manageable. I think we have this. I like the way this play is lining up for us. Oh, there we go. That's fantastic. Another 100-yard rushing game for Henry. He's just so hard to stop in open space, honestly. Glad we don't have to stop him, that's for sure. Let's see if we get Smith open here. Uh, oh, that was supposed to be a... So I tried to throw it short so he would come back to it, but instead he lobbed it up. I get that he's thrown on the run, but that's just that's unfortunate. That's just that's really unfortunate on my part. That's not a good. I mean, I think the throw was fine because he was open. It's just it was an overthrow. But you got to know that when you're throwing on the run, that that could happen, so. I probably should have waited and stopped for a second in hindsight, but. There are no do-overs. Dang it. <sighs> 32. Okay. Oh, they're on 32 now. I'm going to blitz. I'm going to audible here. Well, at least I read that right. Although they still gained a yard, I think. Oh no, they lost a yard. My bad. I, I can now. Uh, in theory, I think I like this. I think we have most of this stuff covered. He, did, he had nowhere to go there. If he didn't step out, he might have gone back to the yard line of scrimmage, but there was legit nothing there. There we go. I think that's the first for Crookshank. I could be wrong. That's the first one I remember for him, so good for him. We're going to audible this to the right. Yeah, decent game, game five. I'll take that. Uh, we're going to... Let's go quick pitch. I think they pretty much expect us to throw it in these situations, so we're going to surprise them. Yeah, gained enough. Let's go wide corner. Smith should have this, I think. If I'm reading the coverage right. I'm not reading the coverage right. I was tempted to die for it, but uh, that that's just asking for something bad to happen. Jacksonville scored. Oh, a safety. Interesting. And he's not in. That was close. Let's go power out. Jeez, he has to be like on the inch line here. Let's go HP Wham. There it is. I like how the game's like, yes they say. Like, he was never tackled, so of course he was in. Ooh, that was just inside. I almost messed that up. Uh, Oh, it's messed that extra point up. Felt very military to me. Very precise, methodical as one of the words you've taught me. That would have been very upsetting. But thankfully, I didn't do that because I've missed enough extra points. Oh, I know this guy. Dang, I went for the big hit, and uh, I paid for it. 
Let's bring them some blitzing pressure here. This is gonna, it seems like it's going to be one of the shorter uh, recordings of the season. It just seems like there hasn't been as many stoppages in this game so far. Like the clock's mostly been running. There hasn't been that many incompletions or anything. So, kind of interesting. I'm guessing it's going to be like a maybe 50 minute recording. Right, it's almost done. done. We're only at 35 minutes right now. Yeah. Good pass. See, like I said, there's just there's not that many stoppages. They just he's not making many incompletions, and we didn't really make any either. So. Speaking of that, now they did th <laughs> throw an incompletion. So. Maybe I should talk about how he's only thrown one interception. They'll throw another one too. It'd be nice if it worked like that. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. So, my power does not exist. That's unfortunate. Got my hopes up for a minute there. Uh, I'll try another blitz. I'm gonna try a fire I'll try cover six. We have some really good corners and stuff here, so in theory they shouldn't get much. Hopefully. Uh, that was really good uh, play call. That's a good play call considering the zone I was playing. Well, we're just gonna bring everybody and hope for the best. Okay, well, all you can really do in this situation. The field goal is good. If only. Yeah, on this play, we're legit bringing everybody and their brother. So, this is either going to be a sack or a touchdown. And yeah, it's a touchdown. <laughs> so. I thought, that, I thought we had a chance there to mess that up, but nope. We should still be okay though, we have a two touchdown lead, so... Still 21-2 in the Jags game, so if we can hold on here... I'm just fair catching that. If we can hold on here, we'll uh, have a nice two game lead. Which will be fantastic. Play action. Let's try it. Let's see if somebody could lose their man here. Oh, he's gone. Up again. Oh, I tried to show, and I messed it up. Oh well, it gives a chance for our fullback to get a touchdown. Doesn't everybody want to see a fullback touchdown? Um, darn it, because I didn't run it. I want to see a fullback touchdown here. Um. Run, fullback run, there we go. Fullback dive, let's go. Let's get him a touchdown, raise that confidence a bit. There we go, big guy touchdown. See, that's, I intentionally let us get down on the one so we get a fullback touchdown. That was totally it, guys. I'm sure you guys all believe me, you know, those, it was obvious that's what I was doing there. You know, so. Totally 100% obvious. And that, oh, that's going out of bounds. Oh, that was, that was terrible. That was horrible. I don't know why, sometimes my timing on those are just 
horrendous. I don't really know why. We're gonna start playing kind of conservative because the clock is very much on our side right now. I think that might be a hold. Or roughing the power on us, never mind. I thought it was a hold. Well, they're uh, on our side of the field in uh, no time. That's uh, not very much not how you uh, kill clock. That is, though. There we go. Third interception of the season for him. Very nice. So we should be well, uh, well on our way here to uh, another win to start the season. Been a very complete game. We've only really given up seven points, or our defense has rather, because the one was an interception that they could do nothing about. I was going to try to juke there instead of the stiff arm, but then again, it's probably asking for a fumble or something. Uh, let's do play action. Let's see if we get Smith wide open here. There we go. Wanted to stay in bounds, and looks like we did, luckily. Alright, I think this should work. Ooh, almost. Gonna keep running here. Actually, we're going quick slants, we're gonna kick it to Henry, I think. There it is. Twenty-two touchdowns on the season for Henry. I mean, you could say we use them too much, but I mean, if you're Green Bay, you probably do the same thing with you know Rodgers and whatnot. So, I think the best te I think teams just use their best player. So. Eight minutes left. This one should pretty much be in the bag for us. It'll take a pretty wild comeback for them to have any any real hope here. So we'll probably just start playing some prevent defenses. Ooh, that was a risky throw. Injury timeout. They've been you know, getting beat up pretty hard this game. Luckily, we've stayed clear of the injury bug. Knock on wood. Hopefully, nothing happens the rest of this game. That was awful. I mean, that is... Oh, God. He's... <laughs> oh, I wanted to get the pick six. Another pick six for Dory Jackson. See, I think people see the scores of my game and are like, man, these games are blowouts. And it's like, no, not really. It's just the AI decides to start doing dumb stuff when they're losing by a lot. We're also going to put our backup quarterback in whenever... Uh, we get the ball back, so get him some playing time, let Tannehill get some rest, avoid injury, all the good stuff. It looks like uh, he's got his Adoree Jackson as his X Factor going for him now. Like, he's just fantastic for us. Like, there's... I was playing on just franchise tagging him and we got to offseason like I said but well, the bye week has like you know what he's just been so good and he's still so young I think he's like 26 or something they're just there's no reason to even you know risk letting something happen long term just lock him up and not have to worry about that position for a while so yeah our defense is uh, pretty dang solid Ooh. Another injury, jeez. I don't know what's happening to their team. It's not even really rough hits or anything. It's just they're getting injured. Oh, 
That was actually a really nice play. That's a shame. I was looking forward to getting our uh, backup out there and see how he plays the rest of this game. But we'll have to wait a little longer, it seems. What's nice is we're actually getting some decent pressure, but we're not really... We're really not uh, rushing with that many people. So that's a very, very good sign for our uh, defensive line. That was a risky throw, which I guess in this situation kind of have to be, right? My guess is they'll go for it on fourth down, too, but it's either that or they've officially given up. I read that. Will they go for it here? They will go for it here. Like I said, I figured they would. They're right at midfield. If you have any hope in this game, you gotta get this. Oh, that should have been picked. <laughs> That's unfortunate. But hey, we take over on downs. And uh, we are going to get our backup into the game. So here comes Blanton. He'll mostly just be ending the ball off, but... Let's get Tannehill out of there, see what he can do, maybe get some get some reps for him, some experience. Um, we're actually going to try and do some throws here. We're going to try to do some throws. Let's go hook here. Okay, we want to we, we get him some reps, you know? Ooh, that was a bit of a dangerous throw. Uh, two play action slide. Looks like the Jaguars are making a bit of a comeback. Will it be enough? Who knows? Yeah, there's nothing open there. Well, not a great, not a great one for our backup, but you know. He didn't throw an interception, so you know, if you look at it that way, that's a good thing. Eh, the seven, that's not bad. It's not the one like earlier, but hey, you, you take what you can get. Yeah, let's see how this works. Yeah, they're going to have to make some quick passes here because honestly... Don't want to give up a safety. Granted, they're a bit farther out now, but at least for that first one, they're only at their seven, so. I don't think he got his feet. Ooh. You know what? We are going to challenge that because when else are we going to use it? I think he only got one foot down. It looked like it was a weird animation. I'm guessing it'll stand, but like there's no other time for us to really use this. And it stood. Okay. It was worth the tr you know it was worth the worth, worth throwing the challenge flag because we weren't gonna use it anyway. Yes, we lost our timeout game, but I mean. I don't think it's going to come back and bite us. I, I really don't. Like, I wasn't really thinking we were going to overturn it, but... I felt like it was worth the... Worth the... You know. It, it basically worked as a timeout for our defense anyway, so... Oh, there we go. How is he still up? How is he still up? This, this, like, Adori, dude, you're, you're, you're overpowered a bit. Like, how did he get out of the tackle? Uh, Adori is just so damn good. Really, really 
Pappy, I decided to lock him up long term. Like, just he, he it feels like every week he makes some kind of great play. So don't think that'll end up biting us at all. Because like I said, he's still young, so that should just be a very, very nice contract for us. So, the, the scoreline looks worse than it actually was. We did not blow them out by as much as this is suggesting. But hey, um, so much for uh, this being the shortest of the season. Because uh, it's turning into being a bit of a longer one now. Because of uh, all the stoppages in uh, the fourth quarter. Ooh, that looked painful. Let's go cover two, Sink. There we go. Very nice. But yeah, this one's pretty much pretty much over. They're waving the white flag, and uh, we're gonna pick up another one to start the season here, which is fantastic. Because I would very much like to buy. Only one team gets it now, and I would very, very, very much like that to be us. But I, I guess, like, the nice thing to do here would just chew clock, and I guess that's what we'll do. I don't want to pick up a garbage time injury. So we will be gentlemanly, and we will run out the clock. Like, I could take Derek Henry out of the game, but, like, the dude does, doesn't get hurt. Knock on wood, so uh that didn't work. Doesn't matter what play we call here, because it's gonna take us to the two minute warning. Alright. Just go let's go fullback dive, why not? Give him some more reps here. There we go. Now yeah, this should uh, pretty much put this game in the bag for us. Don't know that they're gonna call their timeouts either. They uh, they acknowledge that this one's over. Which I guess is obvious because they punted on that last drive, so. But very, very nice game for our team. I threw the pick six, which was obviously not great, but other than that, pretty... Oh, no. Derek, don't do this to them, man. They have a family, my guy. I'm just trying to run out the clock. <laughs> I'm just trying to run out the clock, my dude. And you go and do that to them, that's just, that's, that's not nice, and you just diff on that dude to the ground, that's, that's very rude. I don't think they're going to appreciate that, you might be getting a letter from their parents, saying why you do that to my boy. Well, maybe they'll just take a knee and want to get out of here, I don't know. But uh, this this fourth quarter, it just did not go their way. <laughs> it really did not go their way. But we'll see. What, no, they're gonna throw for it. They uh, they'll go down swinging. And I guess props to them for that. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, we put up 63 on them. I don't know how much honor there is in anything now. Just don't throw another pick six. Just don't do it. Okay, thank you. That'll do it. Very nice win for our team. No, was nowhere near as big a blowout as it seemed, though. That fourth quarter just went crazy. Like, I want to see how many points we scored in that fourth quarter, because this was a game going to the fourth quarter, and it very much ended up being not a game. Yeah, we had two turnovers, which is not ideal, but they had, they had four, so.
The Rams are going to be an interesting challenge for us. So, zero complete... Oh, I didn't check the box score. Well, I can check it here, I'm pretty sure, in the main menu. Because I'm curious how many we got in that fourth quarter, because it, it got ugly, and it got ugly quick. Dory Jackson, 94. Let's, let's do... You know what? Get our full back up. He's been fine for us. He has been okay. Uh, you can get your upgrade. Buckner did. You're a fine depth player for us. And Dory Jackson obviously is a freaking stud. Up to a true 95. 96 with morale. Like, dude's just, dude's just crazy. Absolutely crazy. But yeah, that was a fantastic game by us. How many did we put up in the... We put up 35 points in the fourth quarter. Like, it was a two-touchdown game going to the fourth. That's... It just really got ugly quick. But, uh, that'll do it, guys. I'm gonna ready up. And that'll do it for me this time. We do still have some players to sign. I would like to... Resign. I think Joe Blanton might be earning a contract. I don't know if he's worth that much guaranteed money, but we'll see how we're going to do that. We'll see. And Landry, I want to bring him back, but we're going to have to make some cap space for him. As you see, we just we don't have the cap room right now. We have 414k cap space, so he's going to have to be dealt with in the off season, So, But yeah, that'll do it for me, guys. I really do appreciate everybody watching, hanging out, and uh, yeah, our defense up to an 88 overall. We got some work to do on our offense, but our defense, 88, fantastic. Really, really nice. But we're pretty much standing pat until the end of the season, and then we'll make some room. We'll make some moves in this off season that get us some cap space, so that we could re-sign Landry like. I fully plan on bringing them back. We just, we gotta get the cap space first, so. And uh, that's easier to work with in the off season than it is right now, during the middle of the season, so. That's what we'll be doing. But again, guys, really do appreciate you for coming hanging out. If you're new, please hit that subscribe button. It really does help me out. Leave a like, leave a comment, you know, tell me what you think of our team going into week nine. I will be sure to read any comments I get. And that'll pretty much do it for me, guys. Big game against the Rams next. I'm only a few games away from taking on my buddy Billy and the Jets. Huh, Billy and the Jets. That's that's a meme, I guess. But, yep, that'll do it for me, guys. Really appreciate you guys for coming out. See you guys next time. Have a good night, everybody. Take it easy.